According to the figures by the Minister of Justice and Correctional Services, Gauteng and the Western Cape are the leading provinces with more prisoners. They are followed by KwaZulu-Natal and Eastern Cape. Organizations that champion prisoners' rights say overcrowding violates the rights of prisoners. They say this further affects the rehabilitation and reintegration of prisoners back into society. Overcrowding in itself creates anxiety, it creates panic, and when institutions of corrections are overcrowded, there is less food that must be provided to prisoners. There is less attention there is less security and safety because, you know, the prisons are chronically overcrowded. Prison authorities have considered that overcrowding is a major problem, but blame this on the country's rampant crime. Overcrowding does strain our infrastructure. It means that some of the basic services such as hot water cannot be guaranteed at all times as the boilers get damaged at short intervals as they are stretched beyond the capacity that they can take. We'll continue working with what we have in terms of increasing bed space. The figures also show that there are 30,000 guards who look after the prisoners and this figure is lower than the one needed. Lula Mamaya, SAPC News, Parliament.